Hi, welcome to the 19th chapter in manual testing that is performance testing. This video is brought to you by Ampro Training. Now let's see the agenda of this topic. Performance testing, why to do performance testing, types of performance testing, performance testing tool, common performance problem and possible interview questions. Now let's see what is performance testing. Testing the stability and response time of an application by applying a load. It is a non-functional testing. Performance testing measures the quality attributes of the system. Stability means ability to withstand the design number of users. Response time is a time taken to send the request to the server, run the program in the server and receive the response from the server. And load is the number of users using the application. Now let's see why we do performance testing. It is done to provide the information about the product like speed, stability etc. It is also done to re reveal what are the improvements have to be made on the product before it release. Without performance testing, product will suffer from some problems like running slow when several users use it simultaneously, inconsistency across the different operating system. Now let's see types of performance testing. The first one is load testing. Second one is stress testing, third one is scalability testing, fourth one is soak testing and the fifth one is volume testing. Load testing, testing the stability and response time of an application by applying the load which is less than the desired number of users. Load testing is performed to make sure that what amount of load can be withstand the application under test. The successfully executed load testing is only if the specified test cases are executed without any error in the allocated time. Stress testing. Testing the stability and response time of an application by applying the load which is more than the design number of users. The stress testing is used to determine the failure of system and to keep and check how system get recover back. This quality is known as recoverability. Scalability testing. Testing the stability and response time of an application by applying the load which is more than design number of users and will try to break point where crashes can occur are called scalability testing. Volume testing. Testing the stability and response time of an application by transferring a huge volume of data is called volume testing. Here we mainly test the capacity of database. Soak testing. It is also called endurance testing. Testing the stability and response time of an application by applying the load continuously for a particular period of time is called soak testing. If you take an AO application, then log in as 20,000 user, put load on the server continuously for 24 hours, 48 hours, 3 days, 4 days and check the performance of an application. Because in real time, server should withstand the load throughout the year. Now let's see the performance testing tools. Apache JMeter. HP Performance Tester, Rational Performance Tester, Neo Load Tool, Silk Performer, Web LOA, Open SDA, WAPT, Load Impact, Loadster, Q Engine, Testing Anywhere, Cloud Test etc. These are all the performance testing tools.
tools still there are many more performance testing tools are there in that the apache jmeter hp performance tester rational performance tester are the some most popular apache jmeter is used to test the performance of web applications apache jmeter does not perform all the actions supported by browser highly portable and supports all java based applications the hp performance tester load runner that is the hp performance tester support large number of protocols it supports web application mobile application ajax application etc rational performance tester it is performed and load testing tool developed by ibm no programming language is required for this tool neo load tool it is a tool stress testing tool used to measure the performance of web and mobile applications neo loads exclusive technology allows you to perform web testing more quickly effectively frequently which means you can immediately identify the root cause of any issues silk performant it has a leading web support across all major web environment understand error from the user perspective such as incorrect response miss timer threshold or system error etc now let's see the common performance problem poor response time takes more time to load bottlenecking poor scalability database issues disk usage operating system limitations poor network configuration memory utilization cpu utilization insufficient hardware resource etc now let's see the possible interview questions of this topic what is performance testing why to do performance testing what are the types of performance testing which are the performance testing tools what are the common performance problem subscribe to our channel on youtube like us on facebook follow us on twitter join our group on linkedin thank you